Hi, welcome back. On this video here, we're finally gonna go and get into building objects. Well, not exactly. Before we build objects, you know that we need to define its environment. And its environment is a class, a definition, description, a blueprint of the object. So we need, firstly, we need to set the properties and methods of this object that we will be building. All right. So let's go ahead and define a class. That's what I'm trying to say here. I didn't want to go too deep on it and bore you to death, but let's go ahead and describe. Let's define a class. So let's go to the blank.php. Let's do save as and let's go ahead and save it as a class underscore car dot PHP. Boom. Let's take that off. Save. Hopefully I'm not going too fast for you. Let's open the PHP tags right here. All right. So what is the syntax of a class? All right. So the syntax class is the keyword that we need. All right. To Let's get this going and the name of that class just like functions all right we have a keyword just to let Apache know that we will be creating a class so get ready Apache we will be creating a class and the class name will be car make sure you capitalize that C if you're following me or whatever first letter of that word that you are creating that class it's always got to be capitalized if not it's not gonna be considered a class Ooh, unbelievable right open in curly brackets perfect we have done we created a class so now this blueprint here has to have many things inside and we're not going to go into details in this video here but we will check to see if this class was already defined if it's working right so let's do that let's create an if statement and let's use a function pre-built function of PHP called class exist I believe this is the way the right there and what class are we trying to find out that exists which one is it right here no right here car let's put some quotes in there and write it down so what do we want to say if it exists do we want to say something boring it it, it, it does exist or we want to say something like yay nice it nice right and then if it doesn't work, we want to say something like something really exciting like, no, I hope you're laughing right now, all right? But anyway, we got to leave it like that, all right? So let's go ahead and open it in the browser, all right? And let's see. Oh, yeah, the class is working. Nice. What about if I go like this? Change it. No. That did not sound very exciting. Let's see. Let's try that again. Yeah, nice. The class is working. All right. Let's try that again. No. Man. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video here. So we define a class here. Now the next step to do this, the next step for defining the class is actually creating some, some content for it, right? Some properties, some methods, and, and make it and then at the end the goal is to create an object right so anyways hopefully you were able to get some valuable knowledge out of this and some laughs and i'll see you in the next lecture take care